Hey loves, in today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys some designer inspired bags. I'm going to, today's topic is all about Gucci, okay? I personally like Gucci. It's not my favorite design house, but I like Gucci. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the only Gucci, authentic Gucci bag that I have. And then I'm going to show you two dupes that I found on Amazon that you might want to check out. As always, I'll have everything linked down below if you're interested in any of these bags that I'll be showing in today's video. So the first bag that I have is my actual Gucci bag. This right here is, I love her. I love sis, we've been through it. I've had this bag about almost two years now. Two years ago, I was able to snag this little backpack and on camera it's coming off small, but it is actually, um it's pretty big it's bigger than the size of my head i use this as my travel bag this is the perfect bag when i'm in the airport when i'm doing a road trip whatever travel this is the perfect backpack to take with you i always get so many compliments because this this bag is discontinued gucci doesn't make this anymore you can find some on some of the resale markets like rebag uh what's the other one i've seen it on uh a couple people have it on ebay and places like that where you can get secondhand bags so how i was able to get this is that someone had one in excellent condition and i just purchased it from one of those resellers because i believe this bag originally came out in like 2017 or something and it was only out like by 2019 it was pretty much like done and discontinued to my knowledge so yeah i was really happy it comes in a different couple different colors if you're not a black girl like me but i love this top handle because i can just carry it like this and then of course put it on my back because it's a backpack so hands down if i can find any links to this i will suggest this backpack because it is very versatile again I don't have any issues worth every single dime. I knew that I wanted a designer backpack and I feel like I per picked the perfect one, the perfect size that works for me. Now this next bag is I found on Amazon and it is inspired by the Gucci Dionysus or however you say that. Again, I don't speak English. I'm not French. I'm not Italian. I love these designers. I like the pieces that they make, but don't get up in the comments and like tear me up about the pronunciation. Thank you in advance. Okay, back to the video. So this is inspired um, by the bag. Of course, I have pictures of the actual bag. To me, to me, baby, this is all you need. This is all you need. This is not an everyday bag for me. How I determine if I want to invest in the real thing is how much I wear the dupe. So on this channel, we do dupes, okay? A dupe is not a replica. This does not say anything on here about Gucci. It's just designed after the Gucci bag. So I'm not telling anybody this is a Gucci bag. When people walk up to me and be like, oh, I love your bag. Amazon, 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 okay? It doesn't have any branding on it. Okay, so that is a dupe. So anywho, the um, design um, is, is very, very similar. The only issue that I had with this bag is that the strap that originally came on this denim bag for me, because I am plus size, and this was prior to my weight loss, because since buying this bag, I have lost 20 plus pounds. But at the time, this body, this bag did not fit crossbody. And that was my whole purpose of getting it. I like crossbody bags. I'm a crossbody girl. I need to be on the go, hands-free. And so I wasn't able to, so I did have to buy my own strap from Amazon. And I take this strap off this bag. And... It's very nice quality. The gold hardware matches perfectly. Like no one can tell this is not the original strap. It's a very high quality strap. The straps on Amazon are very, very good. Um, so I'll potentially, if I can find the link to it, because again, I've had this bag over a year. 
So if I can find the links, everything will be linked down below. Um, and the inside is like this blue faux leather that matches the denim perfectly. Um, as far as quality, I will give this bag an eight out of a 10. There are some, a couple stitching issues on the back, but I haven't experienced any color transfer on this bag, which typically happens with denim bags. I know all the girls are now saying that you can just spray like Scotch Guard on here, but I did not know that at the time I would have. So you can see a little bit um, of that happening to the bag, but the best part is that they made the back flap, and I don't know if this is true on the real Gucci, but they made the back flap in that faux leather, so you don't have to worry about um, the color transfer when you're wearing this bag crossbody. But as far as style and design, it's dead on. I wanted a denim bag. This held me down, but I am ready to um, take it out and give it away. So I will have this actual bag linked below, used as is, it's in excellent condition, ready to go to the next person and get some use out of it. So if you want a discount bag, um, it will not come up with, yeah. I'm gonna give y'all a strap. If I can find the link to the strap, the strap will be included with the bag, okay? Oh, I'm gonna have to find the strap. But anywho, I, I'm going to sell this because, again, I have found a new denim bag. So make sure you subscribe so that you can see the new denim bag, baby, because she's, oh, she's nice. So we don't need her anymore, okay? One in, one out. <laughs> now, the last bag in this video was when I saw this over a year ago, I checked out immediately, immediately. I checked out. It popped up. It checked out. And when I got this baby, this was the first go round. Now these are popping up everywhere on Amazon, but this is the original and the quality on this bag, 10 out of 10. You cannot, there is not an imperfection on the stitching. The quality of this leather, pleather, whatever it is, amazing, amazing. The knob is sturdy, it's nice. I don't know the actual name of this bag. It's just like a Gucci bamboo bag. That's how I always search it in the search bar. And it comes right up on the Gucci site. I still got the paper in her. And I still got the strap that just fell. But um, it does come with the leather crossbody strap. I have never worn sis. Never wore her. I just bought the bag because I knew that this was excellent. So because this bag became so popular and it came all over Amazon, Gucci has redesigned this. So when it first came out, this is exactly how the bag looked. It didn't have any Gucci branding on it until you actually, um, I think it's on the hardware here, uh, engraved. And then of course, as Gucci always does, it's inside of the bag. But on the outside of the bag, there was no branding. So no one would know with this bag like this is the perfect dupe again i'm not here to fool anyone where's your bag amazon i'm not telling anybody that this is a gucci because it's not but the design 10 out of 10 the quality 10 out of 10 they nailed it and it comes in a this bag is heavy so i'm about to put it down my arm is hurting but we're gonna keep talking about this bag because it's so good so the reason why I have never worn mine is because I got it in that brown because of it was only original in green. My favorite color is green. But how practical was I going to wear a green bamboo pack? I, it, I, it wasn't practical. And then black, I was like, Jasmine, every bag you buy is black. I have the most of my bags are black. I don't need another black bag. So I said the only other option was available was this nice cognac color and the only other bag i have similar color is like my um uh mcm so i said sure let's go for it let's get her haven't worn her haven't touched her haven't reached for her and now as we're going into spring and summer and it's been a year of me not using this bag it deserves to be with someone else it deserves to be with one of you guys so this bag is up also up for sale 
I will have a link below. Brand new, never worn. It does not have tags on it, only because it did not come with tags. But this is the original bag. It's excellent, it has pockets in the inside for you to use. It's the original tissue paper. And then again, it does come with a strap. Now, what I'm gonna do is, because I still want her, I'm going back and buying it in black. And I should have did that in the first place. And that is like one of the tips that I will say that when it comes to handbags, handbags are an investment. Get the kind of bag that you know that you will wear and get what color you know that you will wear. Because these bags cost too damn much to be sitting on the shelf, collecting dust, getting rusty, getting messed up. So if you ain't going to wear your bag, sell it to someone who is, sis. Because everybody can't get the bag when it comes out. Everybody can't, you know. And if I really love her, if I really love her, I'm going to come back with an unboxing when I get the black one. Because I also got a little strap situation. We're going to hook sis up. We're going to hook sis up. So, yeah. That's this bag. Now, that's last... all I have for you guys in today's video. I just wanted to share with you guys some of these Gucci pieces and inspired pieces as well because i know everybody can't afford to get the real thing honey these bags like i mentioned are an investment so if you know it's not going to be an everyday bag if you know you're not going to be pulling out your closet two or three times a week to wear don't spend your coin don't spend your coin get you a dupe get you a dupe not a replica but get you a dupe Okay, and I'm going to be showing all of you guys the high and the low. I'm going to give options because everybody, some people have the money and they just don't want to spend it. They're not justified in it. And some people can't spend the money. So whatever your situation, this is the channel for you. So make sure you subscribe. I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.